in the name of Jesus Christ who is the son of the living God who gives men the power to heal the sick I decree and declare right now so many phones lifted representing people some following some demonic conditions some death sentences in the name of Jesus the spirit that is back of that infirmity whatever it is called I invoke the name that is above every other name and even the blood of the eternal covenant that altar that speaks above and against every negative altar I command that those spirits depart right now depart right now depart right now now I decree and declare in the name of Jesus for all those who are sick it doesn't matter how long and it does not matter what the problem is I stretch my hands prophetically and I declare be healed now let the life of God surge into your body now in the name of Jesus Christ bone conditions anyone having a bone condition I declare be healed now anyone lying down on the sick bed I forbid you from dying in the name of Jesus HIV be healed now cancer be healed now tumors and growths be healed now partial or complete blindness eyes be open now ears be unstopped now you heard about the testimony of the lady that God gave a brand new womb in the name of Jesus any organ that is failed or failing we command a brand new organ now peptic ulcer be healed recurrent migraines be healed blood conditions be healed There's someone you have a serious problem smelling it's just you know how it's like you put pepper in someone's nose and that stink that's literally how it is for you God is showing me in the name of Jesus you are healed right now the Lord is showing me someone you usually are a straight person you stand very straight but something began to happen to you and you are bending over it's like something is bending you over in the name of Jesus Christ I declare that you are straightened now someone's kneecap you've had severe pain around your kneecap in Jesus name may the power of God touch you There's someone you are you are going you are going to go for a surgery I'm seeing that you are supposed to go for a surgery in two weeks I don't know what the condition is but it had to it has to do with your abdominal region in the name of Jesus may the power of God touch you right now there's someone you have severe breathing problems um, you've not gone to the hospital for any check but you've had severe sometimes you sit down and you are gasping for breath you thought it was because you are adding weight but that thing is still happening to you in the name of Jesus Christ severe breathing whatever is wrong with your respiratory system we correct it now by the power of God you have a problem with your the lumbar area the power of God is touching you right now you almost you cannot bend properly when you bend you feel severe pain the Lord is touching you right now 
Now, whether I mention your case or not, I want you to believe right now. In the name of Jesus, there is a woman, you are not here in Nigeria, your daughter has kidney stones. This is what I'm seeing. The power of God is touching that little girl right now. I'm hearing the name bronchitis, bronchitis. In the name of Jesus, whether here or anywhere following across the globe, I declare be healed now. I'm seeing a woman, in fact, I'm seeing in my vision a woman is holding another woman and that woman is suffering from hypertension. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray by the power of God that woman is healed now. If there's anybody here who came with a mad person, maybe a mad person having any kind of um, psychosomatic disorder, any kind of, you know, issue that has to do with madness, in Jesus' name we declare they are restored now. They are restored now. Repeated malaria, month after month, you treat it, it returns. You treat it, it returns. In Jesus' name, be healed now. Yeah. By the power of the Holy Spirit. And then the Lord is showing me someone, um, not to be embarrassed, but you've not even gone to the toilet in days because you have a very acute, I don't know if you've gone to the hospital, but you have an, an embarrassingly painful expression of pile. This is, is, is this thing with what I'm seeing is not even just like pile. It's like a swelling, even though I'm praying for you, but it will be wise to at least try to see a doctor because what, you know, what I'm seeing is not very good. It's, it's wise and I've taught you here, we believe in the healing power of God, but we are responsible people. You have a situation that calls for concern. There are many, many doctors that are born again and filled with the Holy Spirit. They can be able to examine you. Even if it needs a miracle, they'll be honest enough to tell you. It is wiser to at least get that perspective than to, you know, irresponsibly shrug it away and yet you are not releasing your faith. For that person, I'm praying right now, this night, this moment, may the power of God touch you now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Someone's left ear, left ear, you hear a very, you know, very irritating sound and then that's it. I'm praying for you, be healed now. And pains around the body, any part of the body whatsoever, be healed in the name of Jesus. Now, whether I mention your case or not, in the name of Jesus, who is the son of the living God, I speak healing for you now. 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 This life that I have is a life of God in me. This life that I am is a life. This life that I am is a life of God in me. This life that I am is a life of God. So wait, so wait, so wait. those under the anointing now in Jesus name I declare be healed here's what I want you to do for me we have just about five minutes for you I want you to check yourself whether you are outside any of the overflow our global family and those within here the moment you find out that there is a miracle for you check yourself do what you couldn't do before and we're going to take a few people you find out that the power of God has touched you you need to see the doctors the medical people you can go out to our medical stand very quickly and have yourself checked and I want you to return very quickly now please the moment you find out that a miracle has happened I don't want you to sit back 
it is important that we seal your miracle I want you to check yourself and make your way right to the front even though I know that our time is gone but it's good we take even if it's just one or two testimonies very quickly let's celebrate them as they check themselves there's a